What's going on guys, Michael Benchmark Supply. And today we're going over the differences between Spectra's dual grade lasers, the GL1425C, the GL622N, and then that GL722. So jumping right into it, there's really two main differences, and then a bonus difference if we will, that we'll go over. First one's going to be grading percentage. The GL1425C has about a 9% grading ability, and then if you use that tilt adjustment, it can go up to 15% grade. The GL622N can go on both X and Y up to 25%, really steep grade applications. And then that GL722 can go up to 25% on the Y axis only, okay? On the X axis, it can only go about up to 10%. And actually note with the GL622, you can't do 25% on X and Y at the same time, all right? There's a, it just won't work. So there's about a little bit of a threshold, but you could do really steep grade applications with the 622. Now, the next difference between all three of these is going to be the range, okay? 1425C and the 622, those have a working range of about 2,600 feet. That GL722 has a working range of 3,000 feet. It's got a special antenna um, to allow it to communicate with the receiver. So really long range work. If you're ever doing, you know, mile long warehouses for Amazon or whoever, fulfillment centers, heck, the 722 is a long range king. Now that bonus difference, very, very niche work. But if you need an infrared beam, that is only available in the 622 option. And when would you need an infrared beam? It would need it at airports and railroads. If you're ever working by any of those, you can't have a red beam laser bopping all around those areas. It's actually not good for the conductors and for the actual pilots. So, you know, those are your three major differences between all of these. Um, but, hey, any questions, comments, or concerns, give us a buzz at Benchmark. We'd be happy to get you benched in.